Let's draw the Lewis structure for NH4+. Plus. This is called the ammonium ion, and we know it's an ion because it has a charge after the formula here. So for Lewis structures, the first thing we need to do is count the total number of valence electrons, and we have to remember this plus up here. So if we go to the periodic table, we can see nitrogen right here, group 15, sometimes called 5A, 5 valence electrons. Hydrogen, that's in group 1. All of these have 1 valence electron. So we have 1 times the 4 hydrogens. And then this plus here, it's a positive because it lost a negative charge. It lost an electron. So we need to subtract one valence electron. So we have 5 plus 4, that's 9 minus 1, 8 total valence electrons for the NH4 Lewis structure. This is the ammonium ion. So we'll put the least electronegative element in the center. But hydrogen, that always goes on the outside. So we'll put our nitrogen and then four hydrogens around it. Next, we'll put a pair of electrons between the atoms. That's going to form the covalent bond, our chemical bond between the atoms. At this point, we've used eight valence electrons. We only have eight valence electrons for the NH4 plus Lewis structure. Each hydrogen has two valence electrons, and that's okay because hydrogen only needs two for its highest energy level to be full. The nitrogen in the center, it has eight. It has an octet. So this is the correct Lewis structure for NH4+. Plus. Because it's an ion, we should put brackets around it. And then we'll write a positive sign outside. So this is the Lewis structure for NH4+, plus, the ammonium ion. The molecular geometry, that's going to be tetrahedral. If you need help with that, there's a link at the end of this video for the NH4+, plus molecular geometry. This is Dr. B with the Lewis structure for the ammonium ion. Thanks for watching.